Good morning, everyone. It's Gloria, and I'm here with Lily Beth. It's Tuesday here in Mississippi. We are having a beautiful sunny day today, which is uh, something I've been looking forward to after about a week's worth of continual rain. But uh, the rain has brought uh, very green grass and shrubbery and flowers, so um, I'm grateful for that, although others in the area have experienced flooding, and I'm very sorry to hear uh, those who have experienced the bad part of the rain. Hope you all are having nice weather where you are. I understand that some of our reborn mommies are experiencing a heat wave uh, out in the Midwest, Arizona area, and in parts of California. So I'm just praying that things cool off for you and uh, that you're able to get through through this all right. You know, for the last uh, several videos, I've had Lily Beth in the Carter's Vintage Lines. I have many more pieces that I've not shown you, and uh, hopefully, you know, in the future, I will um, be showing more of those. But decided to kind of do a change of pace this morning and uh, put Lily Beth in Gymboree. Now, the collection that you see here, uh, these, this is a, it's a rather large collection. It has some gorgeous pieces to it. I just love it. Uh, this is all that I have um, to the uh, collection, but it was in 2006, and it's called Cote de Jour. Uh, this is a line that, uh, it, I may have slaughtered the French. Uh, my daughter is a French major, but it's very difficult for me to say the French words with uh, the strong Southern accent that I have. But uh, that basically means um, the French Riviera, the beautiful blue French Riviera. And that's what they call it over there. And so, um, you know, the, uh, the line is aptly named because it has a, a very... Uh, it's just an adorable, a nautical um, uh, themed line. And uh, I love this line from the very first time I saw it. Love the bright colors and a lot of it is in crisp cotton, which just makes it so pretty. And uh, I won't uh, keep you much longer. I want to give you a few of the um, details on the outfit that Lily Beth has on. I'm looking for the sun bonnet or sun hat that comes to the line. I've not been able to find that in the small sizes, but it has little sailboats on it and it has a brim with a ruffle that's in the little red and white stripe. It's so cute, so I'm going to hold off till I can find that. But in the meantime, I have the matching headband on Lily Beth. <clears throat> And uh, it's this, uh, the little outfit is actually a two-piece outfit, a little cotton top here uh, with uh, embroidered little sailboats and rickrack. And then it has the capri pants with the grosgrain ribbon uh, at the bottom. And uh, I'll raise it up so you can see the pocket detail. It's very, very cute here. Um, let's see, can you see that over there? It's hard for me to do this having the camera in my hand. But there it is, a little sweet pocket with Rick Rack trim. And um, let me fix Lily Beth back here. Um, it, they, the line also has sandals that are made uh, with this ribbon, and they are so adorable. But even the, the smallest size, which is zero to three months, that was the smallest size this uh, collection came in. They are huge on Lily Beth, so I did not get those. But she does have on the little matching socks uh, with the the cute little sailboats, and these adorable little T-strap shoes um, are from uh, Shelly of um, Graphic Unicorn. She sent those to me uh, way more than a year ago, and I've really enjoyed using those uh, with different outfits and. Uh, Lily Beth has on the onesie to the collection that has the embroidered design at the collar, which is the same as on the headband. And it has little red bows <coughs> on the puff sleeves. 
And this is the uh, matching bib. Has an applique sailboat, as does the adorable blanket. Now this blanket is very big and I had to fold it so that you could see all the really cute detail. It is lined in a blue and white stripe and uh, half of the blanket is white on this side and the other half is this pretty baby blue. And then up in this corner, it has a little yellow applique sailboat with uh, the uh, embroidered machine stitching little waves underneath. And uh, it's just so cute. It's so bright and um, cheery and crisp and fresh looking. And uh, I've had this for quite a while. Just uh, took me a while to get enough pieces together to make a, an entire outfit. And I've been holding off putting it on Lily Beth. But decided this week that it, with the sun shining and everything, I wanted to get out some bright and cheery outfits for her. And I have a number of new outfits with tags. All of this was new with tags. I was able to find it all. Uh, that way I didn't have to buy any used pieces. So I was very blessed about that. And there's, there's a good many pieces out there. But they are uh, on the pricey side. So I've been holding off purchasing uh, the, the ones that I would really like to have. And then also, it's uh, as in any other... Uh, line of clothing it's hard to find the small size and this line I may have said but it comes in zero to three it didn't come in newborn and uh, they are just a little bit on the <clears throat> big side for uh, Lily Beth but you know I don't mind that they still look uh, rather cute and everything but anyway my friend Linda uh, Doberstein that is coming to visit me in uh, July she has a uh, uh, a, quite a number of pieces to this collection and uh, it was sort of a surprise to learn that uh, when I told her about uh, these that I was collecting for Lily Beth and she told me oh I have those too <laughs> and so she sent me pictures of the pieces that she has she has every piece that um, I have shown here except the blanket but she has a number of additional pieces and uh, she may be possibly bringing those with her when she comes for her visit. And uh, we may get to uh, dress our babies as little uh, Twinkies or twins, twinsies um, then. And I think that will be awfully cute and have some photographs made, hopefully make some videos together. But uh, um, not a whole lot is going on here. Um, hopefully uh, going to have a quiet uh, rest of the week too. Um, I possibly will get Lily Beth changed into something else and come back and uh, share that with you. And uh, wish I had some news or something uh, more to talk about. But, you know, it's just uh, uh, when you don't get out much like me, there's just not a whole lot <laughs> new going on uh, to share. But uh, Anyway, I will let you go now, and I send love and hugs and many blessings to everyone, and looking forward to seeing your videos today, and uh, we will talk with you all again very soon. So I say bye-bye, Gloria and Lilybeth. Bye-bye, everybody.